You can display an applet in a servlet, but to do it, you will need to use the regular applet tag instead of the special JSP tag. Here's an example that passes lots of parameters to the applet. This shows the orbit applet in two different ways. The standard applet tag accepts the same set of options as the special JSP tag. Here you see where the default form of the orbit applet is being displayed in a window that is 550 pixels wide and 130 pixels high. Here is the same applet being displayed again, this time in a slightly taller window, with a number of parameters being passed to it. Here at the bottom is the parameter web link. This is the URL that will be recognized by the applet, and the applet will display the page if you click on it with a mouse. Some of these parameters are color values, and the colors are being passed as three numbers. These are the RGB, red, green, blue, values for the color. With an applet, you can pass the parameters any way you want because you also write the code that reads the parameters. Let me show you how this color thing is set up. Here is where the array of color parameter values is read. The first parameter, named electron color, is a count of the total number of color parameters that follow it. The program loops for that number of times, and the argument to get parameter, each time through the loop, is the name of a color constructed from that loop number. This way, the parameters can specify any number of colors, and the applet will adjust for it. The color objects are stored in an array constructed to hold them. Later in the program, all of the colors are chosen in turn to be colors for the individual electrons. Here at the bottom is how the web link parameter works. Early on, where the parameter was originally read in, this object was set up as a mouse listener, so it would hear clicks of the mouse. Clicking the mouse causes this method to be called. The string argument is then turned into a URL. The status line at the bottom of the page is updated to show the action taking place. And the show document method is called to instruct the browser to display the page specified. And here's what it looks like. The two versions of the applet look very different. Not only have the words changed, but so has the font, the size and number of the orbiting dots, and the background color. And it responds to the mouse if you click on it, like this.